Hey guys, I've got a couple things to show you today. Uh, first one is a seven segment display. Uh, and I've got mine wired up to do number 0 through 9 like you would. I'm not it's not wired to anything right now. It's just it's just set up to be um, say you want number 5. You get a number 5 there. And how this works is uh you send a current uh, through all of them and it's got repeaters down here every line so it stays in its own little line there and if there's a torch here it'll activate this line and if not it won't and each line is uh, color coded for each one of these segments so it's pretty easy to understand uh, there's probably better ways to compact both things I'm going to show you it's just they're just beyond me I just kind of thought this up and thought it was pretty neat, wanted to share it. And that's about all there is to say on that one. And then I also made an elevator. And I like this elevator because it's one button on both sides. And it'll call it and send it either way. And how this works is if is you've got the uh, basic kind of elevator setup, like all, most elevators use uh, this, I'm pretty sure. It's just like two pistons, one on four delay, one on two delay, or just one two ticks apart from the other. But the difference, I don't think I've seen this anywhere, is that I have uh, an ascend and descend function here. Each of these, this blue here and this green, this is the ascend and the descend. And <coughs> What this does is when you push the button and it's down, it'll send a current through all of these and send it through the piston block when this isn't activated. And so each button press activates both of these lines. And what's cool about this is if you're on like a laggy server or something, um, if you've ever seen an elevator on a server like that, it, it often doesn't work and you get caught in it. Uh, you can adjust this. You would just adjust this on each level each of these pistons here, or each of these repeaters pistons, each of these repeaters here uh, to the level you wanted and say I adjusted them to all two here and go out and now you'll notice my ascend will be a little bit slower but which isn't good normally but if you're on a lagging server it's what you gotta do so now I'm going up a little bit slower and then you could even, I'm, I've never even set it to three or four because damn but uh, two seems to work for most laggy servers, and one works on uh, perfectly fine on survival. I'm gonna set this back to one here, and then you'll see like the uh, the decent function. I've got the decent function set to two because on survival, if it's set to one, it will hurt you. But now it's back on one here. Um, yeah, I really I really like the circuit. It's uh, pretty easy to build. I could go into it if you wanted to. Um, basically, or you wanted me to, basically it just, each level is repeated one tick on the ascend and then it's repeated, the descend actually starts on the top, it's repeated two ticks on each descend. And how it's powered is this is the part that isn't compact at all. Is a T flip flop, and both of these buttons are wired to the same T flip flop, just kind of sloppily now. Uh, here's the button there, and there's the button wire here. And when this flips, it starts to power this, and it stops powering this, but since this is delayed, it'll. Here, I can actually. I guess I can just power it like this. If I can get on my. There. It'll send, it'll send this first, letting these power up, and, or actually letting these, yeah, letting these power up and letting this power down because these are not letting it anymore. Here, let's do that again. I'm slow. In the pulse. That was the ascend, see how it went up, and then the descend. You see it, these all descend in order. Um, I, I could do a tutorial on both of these if enough people wanted me to, I suppose. I started to there, but I just didn't really feel like building it again right behind it. Um, I could compact this too, I just, I really don't care right now. 
Um, it's it's fairly I don't know I, I'd say it's like medium expensive. It's about it's two pistons per level and eight repeaters per level. That just I don't know probably like ten dust. I don't know probably more than ten dust, but dust it doesn't matter. And then you've got all the extra repeaters here for the wiring. But it's eight repeaters per level. It's totally stackable. You can make it as tall as you need to make it, and it doesn't slow down, doesn't require more repeaters or anything like that. Um, the only place it requires more repeaters, the taller it gets, is right here. But I had I had one built on another world that went pretty damn high. Just I basically just built this part of it until I got bored. And it it I like it. It works pretty well. It's got a little cute status light there. That's nice. And it's pretty reliable and everything. Down and up. Got the status light. One button. And that's all I've got to show you. I'm clearly stalling for time now, so that means I'm I should be done. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.